Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to update your Pixel firmware if you're rooted with Twerp Recovery installed. I'm going to show you a really simple way how you can upgrade um, your phone to the latest Android Pie. Or if you're watching this in the future, you can do this to apply any OTA. Now the beauty of this method, you don't need a computer, you can do it all on your phone. Also, if you're on stock rooted firmware, for example, you're on Oreo 8.1 rooted and you want to go to Android 90 Pi, you'll be able to do it without losing data. It'll simply apply OTA. You also have to reroute, but it'll be very simple. You just have to flash um, Magisk zip after you root. All right, so let's go ahead and do this. Uh, I'm actually on a custom ROM, so I'm gonna actually have to um, do a factory reset before I install it. Um, but for those of you, again, on stock firmware, um, you'll be able to apply this OTA easily. Okay guys, before I begin, I assume that you already have Twerp Recovery installed on your Pixel device. Um, this will work on Pixel, Pixel XL, Pixel 2, Pixel 2 XL. Um, also should work on future um, Pixel devices. So make sure you have Twerp Recovery installed. If you don't have it installed, but if you have root, you can go ahead and use Flashify app to install recovery without a computer. I have a tutorial on that I made a few years back. It still works. You can go ahead and follow that if you don't have Twerp. All right, um, the first thing you're gonna go is go to Google and type, I right, go ahead and type Pixel Firmware OTA and you'll come to this page, full OTA images for Nexus and Pixel devices. All right, once you go ahead and go to that page, uh, if you go ahead and scroll down, um, it will show you how to sideload using ADB. All right, you can use that method also if you have stock recovery or if you're not rooted, if you don't have your unlock bootloader, you can use the ADB sideload method to update your phone also. But obviously we're, we're dealing with a rooted phone with Torp recovery installed here. And I'm gonna go to Pixel XL, which is what I got. And I'm gonna go ahead and scroll all the way down and download the latest one. You can also downgrade, right, um, to a previous Oreo if you don't like um, Pi. But I'm not sure if the data is compatible if you go from Pi to Oreo. I don't know if it actually works. Upgrade works fine, but I'm not sure if downgrade actually works. So that's something you will have to figure out. I'll try it one of these days and make a video about it. Uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and download the 9.0. I'm gonna go ahead and click on the link. Uh, I've already actually downloaded it, uh, which is Marlin OTA PPR 1.8, 18061. Uh, oh, one more thing with Pixel devices, when you flash OTA, it's gonna overwrite your Twerp recovery. So you're gonna have to grab the Twerp installer if you want to be able to keep your um, Twerp recovery. Go to twerp.me, go ahead and search for your Pixel. Um, I've got Pixel XL here and go ahead and go to primary Americas or Europe and make sure you go ahead and download the latest installer. So I'm gonna go ahead and download this latest installer, Twerp Pixel Installer Marlin, uh, blah, blah, that's it. All right, once you have downloaded the OTA, it's really simple. You can go ahead and power off your phone and reboot into recovery by holding down volume down and the power, volume down and power. All right, once you're here, use the volume keys, go to recovery mode, hit the power key. All right, now at this point, you should see Twerp recovery. If you don't see it, if you see stock recovery, um, you may have lost it. On phones like Pixel 2, Pixel 2 XL, you do have to flash the Twerp zip installer every time you install a new ROM or every time you do an OTA update. And if you didn't do that, you lost Twerp. Then simply reboot into system. If you have root, you can go ahead and um, use Flashify app and flash Twerp without a computer. And then you can go ahead and continue the step. Now, if you're coming from a custom ROM like myself, you will need to go to wipe and go ahead and do a factory reset. All right, and then install it. Now, if you're coming from a stock firmware, you just wanna get the OTA upgrade, do not do a wipe, all right? And go straight into install. And I'm gonna go to my download, and I'm gonna go ahead and simply flash the Marlin OTA PPR1. Go ahead and confirm to flash. So these OTA files from Google, you can actually flash them using Twerp, which is the beauty of it. So you can do it all your info. Um, also, if you're rooted, you can go ahead and install this and then just simply install Magisk, reboot. You'll be able to update um, your stock firmware to the latest one and also keep root, all without a computer. All right, I know a lot of you know how to do this, but if you didn't know how to do this, now you know how to do this, all right? 
Um, you can apply OTA updates on the Pixel phones, the OnePlus phones out of all the Androids. Uh, most other phones, I'm not sure. If your Android device follows the standard Android protocol, um, you should be able to do this on other phones too with OTA files. All right, this will take a little bit, so I'm gonna go ahead and let it sit for a little bit, marinate. All right, go marinate your barbecue, have a smoke. Also, another note, um, if you weren't able to decrypt in your twerp, uh, sometimes that could happen, which actually happened to me, just go reboot into your system, turn off all your security, and then reboot into twerp, then you won't have to actually decrypt it. For some reason, my passcode wasn't working. Sometimes if you have the newer twerp version and you're running the older Android, uh, sometimes it, they will not work. So um, the simple way to bypass that is simply turn off your security while you're doing OTA update. After, you can go ahead and turn it back on. All right, it is done. At this point, if you don't want to root, you can go ahead and reboot. Um, but if you want to root, go ahead and go back to install. Um, go ahead and install Majisk zip file. I've got the latest beta Majisk 16.7, uh, which should work fine with Android P 9.0. And after that, we should be good to go. Wow, this phone can stand by itself. That's amazing with this case. Ha <laughs> ha! Look, Ma. No, um, no salt pepper shakers. Okay, next step. Now, when you install OTA firmware, it's gonna overwrite your Torp recovery with stock recovery. So the next time you wanna get into Torp, you're gonna have to use your computer to reflash Torp. So the best way is at this point, we're gonna go ahead and use the Torp installer and install it from Torp. So I'm gonna to go to install. I'm gonna go ahead and install the Torp uh, installer for my Pixel XL Marlin and go ahead and confirm to flash. All right, and this will give you Torp recovery back on your phone. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and reboot system. Choose do not install. And once it reboots, you should be good to go uh, on the newer Android uh, 9.0 pi with also root now since i did a factory reset on my phone um it's actually going to take a little bit longer but for those of you just upgrading from a stock firmware it should not take as long hi guys so finally booted um i'm gonna go ahead and just skip through the sign sign in here now, if you are upgrading, um, you should not have to go through this. This is because I'm actually coming from a custom ROM. Now, if you don't see Majisk Manager right away, um, sometimes it doesn't install when you install the zip file, you can go ahead and install the APK. All right, install, go ahead and open, and no. Sometimes the first time you do it, it might not say it's installed. So what you can do at this point and simply go ahead and reboot into Twerp and install Majisk and reboot and you should have fully working uh, rooted Pixel. Pixel 2, Pixel 2 XL, blah, blah, blah. So I'm gonna go ahead and reboot into Twerp. Volume down and power. Go to recovery, hit the power button. All right, go ahead and go to install. Go ahead and install Majisk again. All right, if you're watching this in the future, there may be also updated versions of Majisk that may also work. Um, so you can use that if you're watching this in the future. And I'll also update the written tutorial just in case um, things change. All right, go ahead and reboot system, do not install. Now you should be finally fully rooted. Now you can go ahead and use this method to apply any OTA. Uh, obviously to your Google Pixel device, whether you have Pixel, Pixel XL, Pixel 2, Pixel 2 XL, and should also work on future devices, Pixel 3, Pixel 3 XL, Pixel 4, Pixel 4 XL, if you're watching a few years down the, later down the road, because this method doesn't change. It's just been the same for many, many years. All right, moment of truth, Majisk, and boom, shakalaka. There. Uh, if you see that, well, if you see that, you're good to go. Install 16.7. And it seems to kick me out of the app. Anyway, that's how you update your Pixel phones without a computer with the latest OTA if you're rooted with Torp Recovery installed. Have a great day, and as always, stay <laughs> on Pixels. Click here to subscribe, to subscribe, to subscribe, to subscribe, to subscribe, to subscribe, to subscribe.
to subscribe to subscribe